Cinderella. And she was the only child of her mom and dad. They were doing everything Cinderella wanted. Mommy, I want that Chanel dress we saw yesterday. Okay, my lovely daughter. We can go shopping in the afternoon. Daddy, will you buy the diploma? Of course, dear. Cinderella had the newest and the latest of everything. The most ugly clothes, the most modern iPhones, iPads, MP4s, the fastest netbooks and laptops. One day her mom lost her job and soon after died of cancer due to stress, the radiation of the cell phones and the base stations. So the father lived alone with her beautiful daughter. After the morning he passed, he started to look for a new wife who could take care of their house and her daughter Cinderella on the internet. Oh, what? He searched and searched and finally found a woman called Monsterella and married her. Whoa, this woman is great! I should meet her! This woman had three daughters. They were very fat as they loved to eat fast food. Their, their mom was so lazy that she never cooked anything healthy at home. Cinderella's stepmom and stepsisters hated her but never showed this when they were with the dad. Cinderella, bring me some salt. Cinderella, bring me ketchup. Cinderella, bring me mayonnaise. Why are you looking like that? Be quick, be quick. <laughs> Cinderella, my beautiful daughter, why don't you come and eat with your sisters? After some time, Cinderella stand one far away for a year to earn more money. Goodbye, my beloved. Take care of yourself. What would you like me to bring you? I want to name a wild part. I want two partners from the earth and Dolce I want an apple ice one, Daddy. Don't seem dead. Thanks. I'm looking forward to your return. Take care of yourself. The torture day started for Cinderella. At the beginning, all the girls had had separate rooms, but soon Cinderella was deported to live in the dining room. The stepsisters took all the nice clothes of Cinderella. They always mocked and mocked her, wrote emails and sent messages through Facebook in her name. The stepmom and the sisters always shouted at her, made her clean the house, and the worst of all, she wasn't allowed to use internet and her technological devices, such as her iPhone. Now, leave your bedroom. From now you'll be staying in the dining room. But this dress is mine. Of course it's not. It's mine. This iPad is great, isn't it? Oh my god, my shoes. What? How dare they are my shoes. Can I use the internet? Certainly not. Have you finished cleaning the kitchen? Cinderella, did you earn my clothes? Did you polish my shoes? Did you do my homework? Yes, 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 yes. Look what I've written. You are rich, she will lose all her friends. <laughs> we are very wicked. <laughs> Cinderella wasn't allowed to leave the house and go anywhere, so she felt so lonely and bored. Her stepsisters were using internet, and one day from Facebook, they received an invitation for a party from the most famous pop star of the country. He would choose the most beautiful and elegant girl who would play in his video clip of his favorite song. They were very happy and thought that they would be chosen. They were very fight. They were even fighting among each other. Hey, Bruno chose me. No, me. You know I'm the most beautiful and elegant of all, so he will definitely choose me. Shut up! I'm fed up with you. Cinderella was so sad and desperate. When suddenly she remembered the elegant dress that was hidden in the drawer drawer. The stepsisters hadn't seen it. While her stepmom and sisters were deep asleep, snoring caused of too much alcohol. She took the iPhone off one of the stepsisters and looked at her Facebook page and found her and when, when the party was, a few days later. While Cinderella was looking for looking her wonderful dress in her room, one of stepsisters saw the dress and tore it up. Cinderella was so sad. She cried a lot. <laughs> the next day they, was the date of the party and she had no chance to go there. Her stepsisters and stepmom were right laughing and making fun of Cinderella with their excessive makeup, with their expensive cosmetics and their unfashionable art 
craft clothes. You look great in your dress, Cinderella. Yes, great with you, sir. <laughs> she has a lot of pity. She has no elegant clothes, no iPhones, nothing, nothing. And as soon as they left for the party, Cinderella looked for all her stuff taken by her stepsisters and sent them in the house. She also found her purse in which she had some money. She was very happy when she found her MP4 too. She went out to look for her shop and she couldn't believe her eyes when she saw her favorite shop was 50% on sale. Oh my god, I'm very lucky. She reminded me, oh, I forgot to leave it at home. She bought a wonderful dress with a mask not to be recognized by her stepsisters and, and mom, but realized that she forgot to leave her MP4 at home. She decided to put it in her pocket.
I'm really nervous. You're not terrific. So, this is Ryder? Yeah, I still love it. And at the last school I was at, I wish I was there right now. Still, I'm not trained in the heartbreak. Come on, everything will be fine. Hi, girls. Hi, Frenchie. This is Sandy. These are Jen, Marty, and Rita. She just moved here from Sydney, Australia. I want to see this down Fine, thanks. How do you like school so far, Sandy? It's different, don't worry. I want to hear about what Danny did that speech. You really want to hear the whole story from the beginning till the end? Oh, yeah! yeah. Yes, I said it, man. Every dirty and horny 